the fountain of youth, the concept of heal thyself, these are all, have all been ideas that have been fundamental to humanity for thousands of years. Now juxtapose this with the idea of a small molecule drug delivered locally to our body to regenerate damaged tissue. The inspiration for this idea really comes from nature. We all learned in school that sharks are able to regenerate their teeth throughout the course of their life, and lizards are able to regenerate their tail in order to heal themselves. The inspiration for this really caused researchers out of the Massachusetts Institute of Technology and Harvard Medical School to look inside the human body and say, where can we use the human body as an example to show the high level of regeneration? And that really is the GI system in our intestinal tract. It is fascinating that our GI system, literally every four to five days, totally regenerates itself. And it does this because it has well-placed progenitor and stem cells that allow for specific regeneration to occur time and time again in a highly advanced way. And so the thinking was, where else in the body do we find these cells? You find them in the pancreas, you can find them in the back of your eye, and you can find them in your cochlea or for hearing. And so as it relates to the idea of hearing regeneration, it's really important to understand that these researchers under, took this idea and focused on hearing and saw that the hair cells that you're born with, literally that develop when you're in your mother's womb, are the exact same ones that you die with. And so during the course of our life, when we're exposed to noise pollution, these are damaged and destroyed and they don't regenerate. And so their idea was to be able to take small molecule drugs delivered locally to your cochlea in order to get them to regenerate in a very, very quick period of time. It's the idea of harnessing the body's underlying biology in order to regenerate ourselves, and in this case, to regenerate our hearing. Thank you.